Hello everybody, getting ready to do lesson 7.4 of pre-algebra math, part 1, part 2, part 3 available here at the casino. 7.4, the percent equation, we have a 32 point skill sheet today, and we have a 4 point notebook sheet today. Uh, teachers, here's today's spell work for your students, give your students 5 minutes to do this. Okay, welcome back. 82.5% of 160 would be 0.825 times 160 equals 132. So you made 132 free throws. And then for C here, <clears throat> and then what number is 10% of 60? So we use our uh, percent formula here and we plug in. A, we're trying to find uh, uh, what number is 10% of 60? So 10 over 100 equals A over 60, and we solve for A, and we get 6 equals A for that um, problem. Okay, into our uh, lesson today, June 14, 2002. The between Earth and the Moon is about 375,000 kilometers. On that day, a traveling asteroid missed Earth by about 32% of that distance. How far away from Earth? was the asteroid that is in part two i think of this lesson that's what you're headed into this goes into your notebook page one students so make this entry so when i check notebooks either online or in class you'll have this there okay so into our first concept slide you've used the proportion a over b equals p over 100 to solve percent problems when you solve this proportion for A and write P over 100 as P percent, you get the equation A equals P percent times B. So this is our example here of the moon and the asteroid. Here it is here. <clears throat> this is a notebook. The important thing here, uh, students, for your notebook is this slide, is this section here, and then this up here. These two formulas here then this uh, is important too okay so the percent equation you can represent a as p percent of b using the equation a equals p percent times b or a is part of the base b and p percent example one to find out how far away the earth asteroid was as described above use the percent equation so a equals p percent times b right percent so we're going to do it in example one 32 percent of 375 uh, so 232 for p and 375 for b and then solve it so when we do that we get 120,000 <clears throat> kilometers away from earth was the asteroid okay right percent is the decimal we're going to do this again <clears throat> So let's get in practice of doing this. <clears throat> Move our decimal to the left. 0.27 for 27%. Students, this is yours here. <clears throat> Finding a commission, a car salesman earns 6.5% commission on every car sold. This salesman sells a car for 21.8. What is the commission uh, for that sell? So A equals P percent times B. So 6.5% times 21, eight, $21,800. So what is that? That's $1,417. So that's what he earned on that sale of a car. Okay, if the commission of the, of the car, uh, <clears throat> find the commission of the car sold for 23,000. And then down here, students, this is yours. <clears throat> if a salesperson tell TV sales total of seven thousand, how much is the commission with a four percent commission? <clears throat> okay, for uh, number three up here, this would be the percentage up here. So we multiply six point five percent times twenty three thousand, we get fourteen ninety five for three, and that was less than seven point four. Part one, part two, part three available here. Thank you.